Karens are known for their public freakouts, and boy, do they deliver. They can be seen going off on anyone, from store clerks to restaurant staff, and even complete strangers. From screaming at the top of their lungs to pointing their fingers aggressively, these Karens know just how to make an entrance. So the next time you encounter a Karen in public, think twice before you startle her. She might just have something up her sleeve. Karens love to be the center of attention and want that attention focused squarely on them. Even when it's police attention? Apparently so, because here is an example of a Karen who wasn't even on the police radar but really wanted to be and did everything that she could to become the focus of the traffic stop. What you are about to see defies all logic. He was asking how fast he was going. I didn't know. Oh, seven. Hey, are you on probation? Yeah. Were you no? on probation? Not you. No. What were you on probation for? Trespassing. What's part of your stipulations? Submit the search, selling something. Submit the search. No, it is. Yeah. I'm on probation too. Okay. Search my car. Go ahead. No, you not gotta search me. My car is definitely No, me. My car. It's, it's me. Shut okay. it up. Shut it up. You want to search me? Yeah, sure. here, hop out. Can we both hop out? Oh, it's one at a time, man. Just make it easy to put your hands on the car. Yeah, you got another one trying to stick and poke me in your mouth right now. Stay in the car. I'm Stay in the car. I'm just gonna put putting my legs up. Okay? That's it. Just my legs. Just my legs. Alright? Look, just my legs. Okay? Do you guys have weed in the car? Because as soon as you open the door, I. So no, my car always. Well, yours is expired, so. No, mine ain't expired. Mine's expired? Yeah. Mine's just renewed. No, it's I not. Actually, it. do you want to check Jake, mine? Jake, what did you say? No. Do you want to check I mine? Know. I didn't ask for yours. I'm talking you to him. You said mine was a child. I didn't say anything about you. You just did, though. I did not say anything about you. I, I don't even know your name, so why would I talk about what, anything I, you have to do with? Whatever. Check him. Go Chill ahead. out. Get in the car. Bro. No. Up. Shut up. I'm not getting out. Well, I'm not just sit, out. get in there and close the, the door. Oh, get in the car and close the door. Close the door. Get in there and get close the, the door. Car, Taya. For what? Get in the For car what? because I'm telling you to. Taya, stop. Get in the car. Get in the car and close the door. I'm not going to tell you again. Do you understand? Actually, I don't think I do. Put your feet inside She's the car. Get in the car, bro. Inside the car. Now. Now. Get in the car. Right, then go ahead and get out. No. Stop. Stop. Listen, get in the car. Get off me. We're not doing this. Get off. Listen. Listen. Stop. 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 Hey, stop. stop. Do you understand? Okay, I understand. Get the f off me. Are you gonna stop? Handcuffs go. Are you gonna stop? Yes, bro. Get the f off me. Get in the car. Get in the car, bro. You ain't driving. Yeah, that's why I'm driving. Hey, don't you drive. You know what? You're about to go to jail for DUI. Get, get out of the pat get out of the driver's get seat. Get out of the seat. Get out of the car no. now. Get, get no. in the driver. Get in the back. You're gonna go to jail. Get out so the seat cools off, you know? Go over here. Get in the seat. Yeah, get in the seat. I'm gonna go to jail. I didn't do oh, wow. anything. I didn't do anything. Oh. I, I told anything. you to get in the no, car. No, hey, get in the car now. I didn't get do in the car. Anything. I'm not getting no. in the car, bro. I didn't do anything. Why are you rolling guys? Stop. Stop. I didn't do anything. I'm not even racing. As you just witnessed, everything turned out perfectly for Karen because once more she found herself with her hands restrained by the officers. But this time, she was being genuinely arrested. The charges brought against Karen included disorderly intoxication and resisting an officer without violence. Can I wait for my mom to come? No, but I've recently been 
tested for autism. Right. Like, this mm-hmm. one is physically impossible for certain people. I understand. That's why I'm asking Do you if you, you have understand? understand? Up next, we have the story of a 22-year-old Karen who wrecked her daddy's Audi RS5 and made every effort to evade sobriety tests, including trying to wait for her mommy. Let's see how that worked out. You okay? No, there was a deer crossing the street. Okay, you the only one in the car? Yeah, I just called my mother to come pick me up. Okay. okay. You all right? You want an ambulance to come check you out or anything no, like that? No, I'm, I'm fine. There was a deer that just ran right across the road. Okay. You the owner of the car? No, it's my stepfather. Okay. I'm fine. I was trying to swerve out of the way of it, which I know I'm not supposed to do, but... Did you turn off the yeah, obviously? I didn't want to hit it, yeah. I mean, I feel like it might have been worse if I hit it. Do you have your driver's license? Yeah, I do. I'm sorry. And proof of insurance for the vehicle. Um, it's probably in the glove box. I can look for it. Yeah, if you don't mind. What's up? What would you say? I just heard your draft check. That's my stepfather. Where are you coming from? What do you mean? Where are you coming from? I'm going home. Where are you coming from? I ask where you're going. My father's house to my stepfather's house. Okay. You sure you're okay? You don't want to get an ambulance check you out or anything? I'm fine. Okay. Where are you coming from? My dad's house to my mom's house. Okay. Do you have any drinks at your dad's mm-hmm. house? No? Okay. Because you smell like alcohol, okay? I'm getting some alcohol coming off Not your breath, house. okay? Okay. Where, where were you drinking at then? With a friend. With a friend? How many drinks do you have? Two. May I ask you to perform some SFSTs, okay? Field sobriety tests. Can I wait to for my sure mother to show up? What's that? Can I wait for my mom to come? For what purpose, ma'am? Just to do that. Uh, well, I'm going to need to run him through, through you now, okay? Yeah, we're not going to wait for mom. All right, so what I want you to do is come on up here for me. Why does my mom have to come? You're an adult. We don't have to wait for your mom. Why? Because you're an adult. We don't have to. But could you? No. no. We're not going to stand out here all night. Why? So you could do them or not, but if well, you don't do them, we're just going to arrest you. I'm going to get out for 500. I have to do a thought. Do you want to wait? He doesn't know how long. Keep her over here for a second. I'm going to move so there's right. no gravel or nothing. What are you looking at? Your car. Well, yeah, it's not good right now. All right, yeah. come on over here by my car for me. I would like to wait for my mother. We're not waiting we're for We're Sorry, we're not going to wait for your mother, okay? So what I'm going to ask you is we're just going to do some three small little tests here, and then we'll make a determination on what we're going to do, okay? We'll let your mom know everything when she gets here, what's going on, okay? So what I need you to do is stay on this line, face me, okay? Okay. All right, feet together, hands down at your side. All right, mind taking your hat off for me? Um, we're okay. gonna put that. Just hold it down, hold it down on your side right there, okay? Hands down on your side, okay? You, you wearing contacts right now or anything? No. Do you have any issues with your eyes? Any stigmatisms, anything like that? Not Doctor? That okay. So what I want you to do, see the tip of my pen here? Mm-hmm. Just with your eyes and your eyes only, I want you to follow the tip of the pen, okay? Don't okay. move your head side to side or anything like that, okay? And you look at the tip of the pen here. Tip of the pen. Like where your finger is? Yep. All right. Okay. With your eyes and your eyes only. Okay. Don't move your head. Sorry. You did not make that clear. Injuries, any prosthetics, anything like that? No, but I've recently been tested for autism, okay. so I have trouble and ADHD, so I have trouble sitting still. I'm starting okay. law school in the fall, so I cannot really. Okay. All right. So whenever you're ready, go ahead and begin. Thank you for the sympathy. There's none. I could never do that for you. Okay. Try your best, and you gotta also count out loud. Remember, okay? Yeah, I heard you, but okay. I am telling you already, I can't do that. Okay. So you, you want to skip this one? Is that what you're asking? What else do you want me to do? Okay. All right. Like, this mm-hmm. one is physically impossible for certain people. I understand. That's why I'm asking do you if you have Do you understand? We're not going to get belligerent now, all right? I'm not having a problem. I just think this okay. is one that you cannot ask everybody to do. Okay. All right. Well, state and country says that these are tests I've ever been able to perform by any normal human being. Yeah, and okay? we're also in the middle of nowhere. Do you want to do the last one? It's a walk and turn. Do you want to do that, or do you want to... Refuse to take that one. What do you want me to do with that one? Well, I'm asking you if you'd like to do it. What does it require? Okay, I'm gonna. I'll show you if you want to take that. Like one, me okay? not freezing my ass off right now. I mean, not walking. Like nine steps. Like, what do you want from me right now? I'm asking you if you'd like to perform the last. The I last would like test. someone who's not so hostile to ask me what I want to do right now. He's not being hostile at all. So if you don't want to do this last test, home, that's fine. Something was in the road. It was an animal that I did not want to hit, and now I'm I'm being asked to do something that I. And we didn't my mother to show up to do because your, I'm honestly having a panic attack. Your mom's not going to show up, okay? If you don't want to do this last test, that is fine. However, we are going to arrest you for OVI. You just said my mom's not going to show up? We, we don't care if your mom shows up. You're an adult. We're not waiting for your mom. Keep this for the toe come in. Let me see your phone, please. All right, Lauren. Put your hands behind your back for me, okay? What you doing? Right now, you're going to be placed under arrest for driving on the influence of alcohol, okay? I didn't refuse the last test. I did not refuse the last test. Well, you get a chance to blow into our breathalyzer back at the station if you'd like. Uh, this officer here is going to read you some paperwork and we'll go over some stuff. So who's calling my mother to tell her? We're going to let you make a phone call. We'll, we'll talk to mom, let her know what's going on, okay? Do I have to be caught for this? 
You're under arrest right now, so yes, unfortunately you do. I'm sorry. Hi. Hi, Mom. Hi. All right, so okay. she's fine. Um, oh obviously, God. she's had some drinks tonight. Oh, my God. So um, she's been tested, the field tested here for, for field sobriety, which she, she did not pass. So right now, she's under arrest for OVI. She's going back to the station now to do some little some paperwork, but she'll be released tonight as long as uh, you can come by and pick her up. It's like right down the road. So what's going to happen now? She'll have a court date come Tuesday. You know, she's not going to go to jail or anything like that. You know, she'll be released to you tonight. It's with her car. Uh, Where is she? We have a tow truck coming. She just yeah, she, she's in, she's in that she's car. She's in the car there. right there yeah. going back to the station. We have some paperwork and stuff to do. Okay, where's the station? So uh, you can follow me. It's yeah. right down the road. Okay. And then uh, it's about a half hour, 45 minutes of paperwork, and then she'll go. What can we answer for you? What's happening right now? Where's my mother? Your mother's in the lobby. Can she come back here? She cannot. Why? Because you are under arrest. Why? Because you had too many drinks tonight and crashed your car. Because there was a deer in the road. Doesn't matter if there's a deer in the road, you still had too many drinks and crashed your car. So if I did it without drinking, it would have been fine? Like if I... Yeah, if you did it without drinking, it would have been fine. So what would have done that? Um, you would have just got your car towed and went home, but because... No, because my car wasn't working, actually. That's why I said you would have got your car towed and went home, but because you're drinking and you're drunk, you're under arrest. Great. Well, what's a good phone number for you? What do you want, mine or my phone? It's yours. I don't have a phone. I'm not the only I understand you're upset, okay? But you have to own up to what you did tonight, okay? What you made a little mistake, okay? What did I do? You were drinking and you crashed your vehicle. We already been over this. Good thing you so why don't you there. just answer my question so we can get you out of here and you can go be with mommy, okay? I think I'm gonna be on the streets tonight. Do you think she's gonna be going home? She's here to pick you up. That's really funny. Thank you. I know she's here. I'm not going home after this. Okay. That's well, really that's funny. something that you and Mark will talk about. You're 22. Not surprisingly, Karen decided not to give a breath sample at the police station, which was taken as confirmation of her being intoxicated, leading to charges of operating a vehicle while intoxicated, refusal to provide a breath sample, and failure to maintain control of her daddy's vehicle. Despite pleading not guilty, the case continues to unfold with uncertainty. We'll have to await the results. And I offered you a ride I'm not to the hotel. You did not. You're a liar. Dude, just get your oh, hotel. Get the away from me. Ride. Up next is a 32-year-old male Karen who on December 5th of 2022 found himself at Anthony's Bar and Restaurant in Joliet, Illinois. It was there that he became so excessively intoxicated that the bar security had to forcibly remove him from the premises. But when he tried to get into his car and drive off, they stopped him and the police were called and this is what happened next. Get, get your breathalyzer out, bro. And give me, yeah, give me that. And if not, Did bro. Did y'all trespass him from here? You know what, bro? You fucked up for that, bro. Okay. You fucked up for that. Trespassing? You know what? And where's your Uber at? I got you, bro. Don't worry. Yo, don't yeah, worry. Yeah, I activated my bike. Again. They won't even let me leave. Yo, they didn't give me a breathalyzer. Yo, they blocked me in right now, bro. I had two drinks. Look at this. Toilet. It's toilet with a J. Yo, 50K a year. They said toilet with a, with a J. Did y'all see his Uber thing or? Yeah. He showed me something, but it might it could have yeah. been a screenshot at this point, man, honestly. Oh, Do okay. you guys want to handle it how you want at this point? He doesn't want to calm down or listen. So. Well, he's in a running car. Yeah. yeah. So whatever um I really like wanna, to you know say if you want to move and then he takes off and I stop him. <laughs> see what happens. For real. This is the rabbit hole you want to go down? No, no, no. The cold. I'd really just like to go home. So staff staff would like you to leave the property so I can give you a ride. No, I'm over. getting over, sir. Okay. Yes, yeah, sir. Are you are you the um what are you? Yeah. I think I'm the police. Are you them? Yeah, I know who you are. Yep. I, I want your security here, bro, because I'm not driving and I drive safe. Bro. You understand you're in, in a, in a can running I stand vehicle. Up? Can I stand up with you tackling me and like causing a scene? It's all on video, by the way. You understand you're sitting in a running vehicle. Yeah. When my actually my vehicle's not running, by the way. It's a uh, nice try. It, it it's was. On. It was never. It was. Actually the music was, was running. It's not. It it's was. A, it's all on video. I don't care. That's fine. My body cam is on too, and it's recording yeah. that. So you kind of have two options at this you're point. You're blocking me in for the last ten minutes, and my car's not being running you're at highly all. Highly intoxicated, and you shouldn't be driving. Yeah, and I'm not. And I offered you a ride I'm not to the hotel. You did not. Yes, I did. You're a liar. Then hey, how do I know you stayed at the Hampton Inn? Hey, because you told me you stayed at oh the Hampton Inn. Oh my God! And I offered can you, you bring a ride. me there right now? Absolutely, I offered you Let's a ride. Let's go. Let's go. Because if not, I got a lawsuit, bro. Where's your? Can I just see your room key? Yeah, you can. See that you stayed at the Hampton Inn, and then if you don't mind, without tackling me like a like a savage little blue 
to me. Boy, like there you are. Here you this, go, this, bro. Can I go in the car? Can I just see your room? Key? Yeah, that's what I'm in the car without tackling you me. Have, you don't have to snap your yeah. fingers. Yeah. If you don't mind, I'm not driving, sir. Just show me your Hampton Inn room key, and I'll yes, give you a ride over there. Can I please go in my car? with you stay the f there, though? Don't step. You want to grab bro. a Hampton? You're not, Hampton you're not coming to me at all, bro. You I'm, step. I'm you stay right there. You're, I'm you're not under investigation. Stay right there. So I'm just seeing what you're grabbing. You blocked me in. I yeah, did. yeah. Keep stepping in, bro. Yeah, I don't know what you're going yeah, for. Yeah, keep in the stepping car. in. Stay there. Yeah. I'll, I'll help you out. I'll put my I don't need it. on. I don't. I don't need my keys. Here we go. No, go you ahead. You want to get your hand I'm getting in. Uber. I didn't have an Uber on the way. Just Please. grab your hand in. Get out of my car, bro. Without I'm not without, in your without car. proper investigation. I'm not in your car. Bro. Get out of my car without make, proper. If you make contact with here. me one more no. time, you're gonna get arrested. Yeah. Do you understand that? Away. So yes, would you like a ride to the Hampton Inn or not? Yes. Just show me the Hampton Inn. Then just step the away from me. And I'll give you a ride to the. Yeah, no problem. That's it. So just. Show me so room back key. up, sir. I was trying to assist you. Public with my flashlight. servant, step away. If you spit in my face, there's going to be a major problem. I'm not stepping in your face. Spitting in my face. Oh, spitting. Yes. I'm not. So I'm asking you to show please me. Please step room away, key. public servant. Please. I'm not driving drunk. My car's not on. Please you step were away. I've been in this car several times, so. Please step away. Well, you're the one that got <laughs> into this area. I was actually. Back away from me. Are you going to get your hotel key? Back out? away from me. Back so away from me, sir. Would you like you to leave the property? Yeah, back away from me. So you have kind of yeah. two options at this point. I tip them thirty percent. Back the you away like from me. To leave? Yeah, yeah. Back away from me. Okay. So you need to leave. So I'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna open this up without any problems. I'm gonna get the hotel key that he's requesting, and you're gonna back away from me more than this arm length. You're telling me right now if you your make car's been backed up. Me, your car's been. Gonna be, you're gonna get arrested. All right, that's it. And All I'm right. telling you, if you make contact back away. with me, you're yes. gonna get arrested. Back away from me. I'm asking you to get your hotel key. Back away key so from me, so I feel safe. And I'm asking you to get your hotel yeah, key. I will walk. You're the one that keeps getting in my face. Back away. Do you notice? that every time I step back you get closer to me dude just get your oh, hotel get the away from me bro, just get your hotel key and I'll give you a ride hey bro I called you an Uber Thank don't you. drive I'm not <laughs> driving get the awesome. away from me I'm not driving my keys oh, awesome. are here awesome. get the awesome. away from me six feet and I'll give you my <laughs> my hotel key you and I'll show you I'll verify where you're staying so I can get yeah 105 a year bro uh, I don't oh, and I and I and I donate to your stupid cause for you being a dickhead. Hey, Back brother, away from me, bro, man. You're, you're really you getting close you're to getting arrested for trespass. Well, sir, well, if you don't mind, I need a cigarette okay. from my property. I'm not refusing to leave you and so, I have this all in recording. You're a f***ing liar, dude. Okay. I, I tip so 30% have... on Wednesdays. Hey, I tip 40% on Thursdays. Stop, I tip 50% hey, on Fridays, bro. You know what, where, where you going? Where you going? I'm I'm premises. You going to Yeah. All right, come on. I they want to see my hotel key. I'm going to show them right now. No. This is up the way you're treating me, cause I didn't do shit to you. Am I under? Am, 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 am I being detained? No, but I, no, then step but away from me. Cause this is me. No, but I don't know yeah, what's in that car. This is me. This is your I'm last not... chance to leave the property, otherwise you're yeah. gonna get arrested for trespass. Yeah. Do you understand me? Yeah. So, so start I'm walking gonna, or call an Uber. Yeah. So I'm gonna get an Uber. Do you mind? This is the last time you're gonna be told this. Do you mind? Yeah. Yeah. So either take this free ride. I'm trying to get my money. I'm trying to get my 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 phone. Get your money, your phone. Yeah, that's that, that's all I'm. I'll take you to there. I'll be yeah, kind of you know, ready? There's your Turn it off, bro. Yeah. Okay, take up the free ride. Let's go. Take up the free I'm ride, man. Go home. All. You're being rude, bro. No. What the no. f did I do wrong to you, bro? Just go home with At the all. free ride. Let's go, bro. bro. I, tell you, I, hey, I can tell you one start thing. Start walking. I can tell Get you. out of my yeah. face and start walking. I can tell you one start thing. Start walking. I didn't do this. Start walking. I'm recording still. Start walking. Yeah. Start walking. I've had enough. Go. Can I get a lighter? Start walking. Push I got one more truck. Then you're going to go to jail. Have a lighter. Let's Last go. chance. Oh. If you don't get in the car, you're going to jail. Can I tell you oh, one thing? Bro. I got this all recording, bro. Great, Remember I do too. That. It's time to go. Let's go. To go. Thank you. You need to stop go. walking up on us and yeah. go home. I'm not Simple walking up on you. Go home. You press me take for the what? Take the, the little. Get out of my face and don't spit at me again. Face, bro. It's on recording. Get in the car. Please, I dropped it. I dropped it. I dropped it. You dropped anything. I dropped it, dog. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere with y'all. You know what? Take it in. I'm walking my ass. Um, put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Oh, ow, 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 ow. What the f behind your back? What? Put your hands behind my your back. My hands are here. Oh, oh my, I am rotating a surgery. Ow, ow. What the f did I do? Ow. Stand up. Stand up. I can't stand up, man. You broke my shoulder against me. Oh, 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 no. Get up, man. Stop no, I can't, dude. You broke my, my left shoulder. No, stop. Oh, 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 oh. Uh -huh. Yeah, dude. 
Stand up. Yeah, no, man. Let's show it. Stand up. No, you don't. Yo, please. Stop. 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 My left shoulder. Stop. Stop. Please. What do you guys tackle me for? What, dude? Have a seat in the car. Wait, please, please. Have a seat in the car. Have a seat in the car. All my stuff's over there. All my social security card. Have a seat in the car. Wait, please, please. 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 What are you doing to me for what? Get in the car. Oh, for what? Get in the car. Watch your hood. For what, man? Uh, yeah, we got all now, your things. I'm suing you, bro. That's fine, man. No, I'm suing you, bro. Hey, dude, do not I take the belt buckle. I'm taking you to court, nigga. Do not take here. the belt buckle. Fuck you! Don't uh, talk to me. Seat belt. Do not take the seat belt off, dude. Am I under arrest? You let me go home. I'm going home and I'm going to the lawyer right away. That's yeah, fine. Yeah. I don't see any of it in here, so I need it now. I want to get dropped off here. I want to get dropped off right here. Right here. I don't want to go where you're bringing me. Don't let me go. Are you bringing me to jail? No, I'm taking I, you back I, to your motel. I want to get let go right here. I'm taking you to your motel. I want to get let go right here where you're bringing me. Pull over. Pull over. Pull over now. No. You're kidnapping me. You're kidnapping me. Pull over now. What are you doing? The doogie on me. Oh, hit you too? Just a little bit of a okay. mist through the side cage. I, I mean, I'm just, I'm trying to figure out what we can do with him to get him back to the motel. We can just, let's do this. Let's do our due diligence. Let's take him out. Let's re-handcuff him behind his back. Let's yeah. seat him back, seatbelt him back inside. Okay. And let's just try to make it up to the to the motel. Okay. Let's let's just try that. All right now, with guns, like please. Come on out. They're all outside the car right now with guns. Please get away from me. Come on out. Let me go. No, let me go. Let me go. Let me go, public servant. No, we're going to take another stab at it and try to get up to the motel. I'm telling you right now, no, if you spit on me again now. through the shield, you're going to go right to Kelly. I'm going to get out now. I'm going to sue you. Get me out now. I'm going to eat you alive. That's the second to, time. No, I need to. the second pull. time you spit no, on me. No, I need to go now. I need to pull over now. Pull over if I get you arrested. Pull over now. He's going to be in custody now for egg bag. Pull over now. I'm just going to go right to county. Pull over. I'm going to sue you. Pull over now. They're bringing me to county right now. They're bringing me to county, please. Yo, for the for the for the record, please. I didn't do nothing wrong. They bring me to county right now. This guy's got something against me. They put me in the same car as the guy who had something against me. After all the coddling, after all of the kid gloves, Mel Karen was finally accused of committing an aggravated battery against an officer and trespassing on property. However, the current status of his case is undisclosed. We don't know what his sentence is which adds an air of mystery to this entire situation. Back on January 4th of 2022, a law enforcement officer pulled over a speeding vehicle. However, it quickly became clear that the male Karen driver was heavily under the influence. But you will hear this male Karen driver mention a very specific reason not once, but twice to the officers as to why he should not be pulled over and should be allowed to simply drive home. And this is the epitome of entitled Karen behavior that plagues our great nation. Be South Dakota Placida. South Dakota Placida be pulling to Merchant's Crossing. Send me another unit, please. Hi. Hey, how are you? Turn the car off. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Stop digging around. Put your hands on the steering wheel. Where are you coming from tonight? Englewood Beach. Englewood Beach. Do you know yep. the speed limit coming off of Englewood Beach? 35. It's 35. How fast do you think you were coming over to the bridge? I would assume 40. 55 on a radar. On a calibrated really? radar. And then I had to punch it to catch up to you here because you gunned it. Sure, sure. Give me your license, your registration, your proof of insurance. Okay. Uh, so I just moved here uh, four months ago. Four months ago? Where from? Wisconsin. Wisconsin? I know, bold, right? Cool, man. So I didn't, I didn't get my license registered yet. How long have you been here? About, about five and a half months. Okay, well, I'll tell you what, I'm not going to give you a hard time over that, but technically in the state of Florida, you have 30 days to get it. Yeah, so, yes, sir, I appreciate it. Yeah. Okay. So we'll work with you, okay? So here's my uh, license. The Florida, oh, so you do have a Florida driver's license. You just have a registered, yes, sir. You yes, have a registered sir. vehicle. So I, I bought my, I bought this entire car okay. two months before I moved here. Got it. 
So I didn't get my I didn't get my plates yet. Okay. And uh, that's a credit card. I don't need that. Yeah. Yep. So in, uh, registration. What is that? The basically when you register the car in Wisconsin, yes. they give you some. Paper so I don't have that. I got pulled over like a week and a half ago because I just moved here and I didn't have the uh, registration yet. Okay. Because I just moved here a month and a half before I bought the car. Okay, got it. Do you have your insurance? Could you pull that up on the I phone? I do. Yeah, yeah. If, you, if it's easier for you, you can pull it up on the phone. Where did I put my phone? <laughs> Where is your phone? I don't know. <laughs> but either way, I have the paperwork. Okay. Step out of the vehicle for me, okay? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You guys may be nervous. I lost nothing, my phone. Nothing to be nervous about, man. It's probably it's still in the car, okay? Can I turn my car off? Yeah, please. No, it's already off. You already turned it off. Remember I asked you to turn it off? Yeah, yeah. All right, we're coming right back here, okay? No, you're good. Come on right back here. I'm not worried about your speed, okay? Yep. Speed? Yes, sir. You could get a warning for the speed. That's yes, not, sir. not a big deal, okay? How much have you had to drink tonight? Six drinks. Uh, six drinks? Six drinks. Okay. But like, but like since like... How long? Eight, over how long? 8 p.m. 8 o'clock? Okay. It's been a while. It's been a while? Okay. I met a girl on Instagram, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I hear you. Here's the deal, okay? Yep. I'm going to give you a warning for the speed. I'm not worried about your speed, okay? Yeah. I yes, want to make sure you're able to get in your car and drive home from this place. Yes, sir. Okay? And what, the way that we do that is through standardized field sobriety tests. Yes, sir. And that shows I've, you. I've done two. You've done two? I've done two. I'm from Wisconsin. <laughs> okay, I got you. So that's what I'm hoping to achieve tonight, okay? I want to make sure you're able to get in your car and, get in, and, and drive home from this place. Yes, okay? sir. So you're on board with that? Yes, sir. Okay, give me a second. I gotta get some stuff. I'll be right back with Can you. Can I take okay. my hoodie off? Stand right here for me. Please. Do whatever yeah. you want, but stay right here. Don't leave your hoodie on, man. It's cold out, buddy. What? It's cold out, man. No, I know. I know. I'll give the valet I'm not gonna walk. Sure, go ahead. Thank you. That far, thank you. Where are you from in Wisconsin? Uh, Brennis. Yeah. Anywhere near a big city? Yeah. What? Anywhere near a big city? No, uh. Rhinelander? Sorry, buddy. I live like an hour and 20 minutes from uh, the Canadian border. Oh, so you're kind of way up there, aren't you? Yeah. So do you live down here part-time or are you just down for vacation? I, I moved here uh, four or five months ago. Yeah. Okay. But, I, I, but I, I grew up in uh, Fort Lauderdale. So you went from Fort Lauderdale to Wisconsin back over Yeah, my mom moved me to Fort Lauderdale, Fort Lauderdale in uh, 20, 2017 and a half, whatever. And uh, I moved to South Carolina in 2016, and I hated it, so I moved back to Wisconsin and moved back here like 2015. No, 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 I'm sorry. Like three and a half months ago, so like 2017, whatever. Okay. Yeah. I got gotcha. you. Go ahead and relax for a minute. I'm going to stay with your hands out of the picture. We're not out of ease. Couple questions. Yeah, we're having a couple questions for you for for yes, sir. anything. Okay, are you sick or injured right now? My what? Are you sick or injured right now? No, sir. All right. Um, if you will, see, come out here for me. We're gonna stand right here in the center. Okay, you face me. For this first one, we're gonna stand, feet together, arms on our side. Just relax. We're not rigid. We're not out of tension, right? At my, at my hips, right? Yeah, just right here. Just just kind of stand like that. You're doing just fine. Okay. Can you see? Whoop. What was that? Somebody dropped the box or closed the door or something. Are you okay? Checks out. Yeah, yeah. I just. I got you. I heard it too. I know I heard it. Let me see. Do me a favor. Yeah, just like that. Arms on your side. Can you see the red tip of my finger right here? It, oh, oh. Yes, sir. I can. The red tip of my finger right here? Yes, sir. I can. You're going to follow with your eyes and your eyes only, okay? It's going to start going back or side to side, but it's going to follow with our eyes. Yes, Do you sir. understand? Yes, sir. Do you have any questions? No, sir. Okay. Right. You see how it started moving? We're gonna Center. follow it. We're gonna follow with our eyes and our eyes only, okay? Yes, sir. Center. Right. You see how it's moving? Yes, sir, I am. Follow it with your right. eyes. Right, center, right. See how, center. see how it's moving left I'm, and left? I'm listening, sir. Right. Do you understand? Center down. Do you understand the instructions? Yes, sir. Why? When it moves side to side, you're gonna follow with your eyes without moving your head. Do you understand? You have to follow with my eyes, yes, sir. Without moving your head. Yes, sir. So when it goes back and forth, left to right, back. I follow with my eyes, not my head. Yes, sir. Okay. Following. Right. Okay. Down. You look straight at me. Is there a reason why you're doing that? Do you not want to participate in this? I look straight at you. You're looking straight at me. Without I did following. not. I follow. I followed the. You did not. 
Incorrect. You didn't. After you yelled at me, I followed it to the right. I didn't yell at you. I haven't yelled at you yet. I'm, I didn't say. So, I, okay, we're going to start again. Okay. Okay. Follow Feet me. Feet together. Arm down our side. Yes, Can you sir. you see the red tip of my pen? Yeah. Yes, sir. It's, it's going to start moving left and right. We're just going to follow it. Now that eyes. I mentioned it, it's probably going to go to the left first, but then it's going to go to the right, and I'm going to follow it. With your eyes. Yes, sir. You're going to move your eyes. You, know, you want my hands back here? Whatever's more comfortable for you. Just yes, relax sir. and relax. Yes, sir. Okay? Uh, like that. I'm relaxed. Okay. Yes, We're sir. going to follow through eyes and eyes only, okay? Yes, sir. I see the light to my left. I'm going to follow the red to my right. Yes, sir. Red center, red left. Red back to the center, red uh, white left. Red to the, to so the see right. See how we're still moving our head? I want you to keep yes. it still and follow with your yes, eyes. Yes, sir. I'm following my, my, my eyes. No no head. Right. Red to the left. So that, see how it stayed to the left? I want you to keep following it, but I'm moving your eyes. My eyes there are still go. to the right. I think you meant right, but okay, so they're see, still to see the how, right. See, see how it moved? We want it to keep following the red you light. You want me to follow the red light? I'm following. Ready? Right. Right to the red and center and left. I still see the red and the white to the left. And we're going back, center, and to the right, red. White is still to the left, red to the right. Red to the fucking middle, red to the left with the white. I'm still following the white or the red, red to the left. Red is going towards the right, to the far right. But he stopped mid. Red is back to the white. Red is going towards the left to the white, but not 100%. I'm still looking at the eyes. Red is middle. Red is middle. Red is going towards the white. Towards the white. We're not He's following with our eyes anymore, sir. We're going to move on, okay? We're not following to the right. What am I? Following with my f***ing balls? I don't know, buddy. I don't know. Pay attention to him. Yes, sir. For this next one, so you've got a nice line right here. Yes, sir. Okay. And it's called the walk and turn, okay? Yep. Are you comfortable with your shoes? I see you're wearing moccasins. Uh, I mean, they're not the best, but if you'd, like to take, if you'd like to take them off, the right ahead, okay? Uh, it's up to you. It's a nice clean parking lot. I don't see any rocks. I don't see any glass. I don't see anything that would be a yeah. hazard. So if you'd like to take them off, ah, the right ahead. Man, this tough. Okay. So would you rather do it with your moccasins? Ah. I think I'll do, I think I'll do without you can take them off, go right ahead. I want to make sure you're comfortable with this. Yeah, yeah, I think I'll do without. Okay. All right. So, this is our line. We're going to use this, okay? When I instruct you to begin, we're going to keep our arms on our side, too. We're not going to be not airplane, okay? So, when I instruct you to begin, you need to take nine heel to toe steps along that line. You need to take nine heel to toe steps back in the direction you came from. When you are ready, go ahead. One. Two. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Right, turn your arm officer. As I instructed. One. Five. Six. Are you done? Not yet. Seven. Eight. Do the fine. Stay in there for me, okay? Like this? You want to put your shoes on? Go right ahead. They're right there. What do you mean? You can put your shoes back. I'm not done. I I'm not done. I, I thought you were done. Excuse me. No. No, sir. I'm not done. What do you want from me? I'm not done. What did I, just, what did I instruct? And you demonstrate. asked me two steps ago if I was done. How many steps did I instruct you to take? You told me to go back and forth. I didn't tell you I was done. You, you really didn't. You didn't ask me if I was done. You didn't. I'm not done yet. You let me know when you're done. Okay. My, my, foot, my feet are there, right? Well, the end of the line's there. 
Okay. Depends. What do you want? Go back to the back of the car. Watch it. Put your scrap shoes. God damn it, man. Dude, I'm a white male. I'm a software developer. What do you want from me, man? I broke with my goddamn girlfriend. Sorry to hear that. I know. So am I. What do you want from me? Are you fine? Put your hands down. Relax. We're still just talking. Come here. Come over here, man. Right here. Okay. Um, for the next one, it's called the one-leg stand. Would you like to try it? Sir? The one-leg stand. Would you yeah, like to try I've it? Yeah, I've done it all. Trust me, I'm from Wisconsin. Okay. Can, can I get rid of these shoes? Would you like to do a barefoot? It's up I, would, I would like to do a barefoot. Kick them off right there. Right here. God damn, man. Ah, it's so it's so salty and cold. What do you want? Okay, so we're staying right here, okay? When I instruct you to begin, you're going to lift one foot. You're choosing. It doesn't matter. It's one. Yes, sir. Approximately six inches off the ground. Yes, sir. You're going to count, you count out loud. 1,001. 1,002. 1, until you, yes, sir. Until, I, uh, until you tell me to stop. Yes, it'll be roughly 30 seconds, okay? Yes, sir. Do you have any questions for me? No, sir. When you are ready, go ahead and begin. Which foot, sir? It's up to you. You choose You choose the foot. 1,001. 1, 1,002. 1,003. 1, 1,004. Straight out our leg and pour it out towards the horizon like I showed. 1,005. 1,006. 1007. Would you want to restart? 1008, 1009, 1010, which is 10 seconds maybe? 11. 11, 11,001, 11,014, eh? 12,000, 13,000. You can stop. For this next one, we're going to stand the same way, okay? Put our feet together, arms on our side, okay? Gonna make two pointer figures for me, right here, okay? Bring it back down to your side, okay? When I instruct you to, you're going to close your eyes and tilt your head back, okay? For now, you don't have to do it. Just watch me, okay? Okay. So I'm you're going to close your eyes and tilt your head back, okay? I'm watching. Okay? When I say left, you take the left tippy tip of your finger and touch the tip of your nose, just like that. Yes, sir. So when I say left. Left finger, left nose. When I say right, you take the right tippy tip of your finger and touch the tip of your nose, just like that, okay? Right. Left, yep. Now, yes, when sir. I say tip of your finger to tip of your nose, I mean the very tip of your finger... Not yes, the sir. head, not the side, not the nail, nothing like that. Yes, sir. Tip to tip, just like that, okay? Yes, sir. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Do you have any questions for me? No, sir. Okay, so when you are ready, go ahead and close your eyes and tilt your head back, okay? Just like that, okay? Left. Left, left arm, left nose. You put your hand down. Each time when I call the instruction, you just bring your hand down. I'm not going to tell you, okay? Yes, sir. Right. Right. Right arm. Right nose. You bring your hand down. Yes, sir. Down. Bottom Le right. Left. Left. Left arm. Left nose. My left nose you is... Can bring a, you can bring your hand down. Yes, sir. Down. Both arms are down. Right. Right arm right here, up, itchy, on my nose. You can bring your hand down. Yes, right arm going down, both arms are down. Right. Right arm going up, right here, itchy again. Right point of finger on my, on my nose. You can bring your hand down. Yes, sir. And left. Left, right here. On my nose. Not letting go until you tell me to. That wasn't the instruction. I told you you could bring your hand down each time. Sir? Bring your hand down. Relax. Down. You said you had about six drinks tonight? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, a little less, actually. Less? Okay. You feel comfortable? Like you were able to operate a motor vehicle? Yes, sir. No I'm, problems. I, I'm, not, I'm not more than a half a mile from home. Right now, you feel comfortable enough. You can just get your car. Yes, sir. More than, more than comfortable. Yes, sir. Okay, we got one more to do, okay? For this yes, one, we're going to stand just like that. We're going to bring our hands to the center of our back. Hands around your back. Where do you want me to face? There you go. That Put way. your hands together. Yes, sir. You'll be placed on the rest of the night for DUI. Don't, don't be so good, sir. Appreciate your cooperation. You're doing just fine. Really? I'm, a, uh, I'm arrested? Yeah, you got a DUI tonight. Really? Yeah, for real. Yep. It's a good one, too. Yeah, you had entirely too much tonight. Really? Yeah, dangerous. Okay, 
What do you have in your car that needs to go through the jail? You have a phone and a wallet? Yeah, I got a phone and a wallet. Okay. Yeah. Is, is, there, is there anything else you want in there to go with you? No. Okay. We'll can, grab, I, can, we'll can, for can I help you through my we'll grab, car? We'll grab what she's in there. Okay. Come well, on. We're going to go to the car. We're going to go around back. Can, can I help you guys through my car? No, we're going to go through it for you. Do you have anything in there that we what didn't know about? Why are you going to go through my car? No, don't start. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey. Stand, hey. Up. stand up on your feet. No, up. listen, I got... Do not do this. Stand up, be a gentleman. We're going no. To, we're going to that car right hey, here. Hey, listen. I reserve... Hey, stop. Hey, walk. hey. Walk. Can I... Walk. Hey. You're going to catch what resisting. Oh, no. Do not do that again. Hey, can I regret? You planted your foot in the car and you ran into me. Bro, do not do that I again. love them. That's your freebie. Guys, I love police. Do you have anything okay, you should have? No, nothing. Yep. I just, Stand. hey, listen. Your car's going to get towed and we're going to inventory for a good seat. Listen, okay, can seat. I talk to you guys for 10 yeah, minutes? I'll talk to you. Yeah, he'll talk not to you. even. Take a seat. Five minutes. Listen, holy Slip. fuck, these are serious. Slide backwards. Guys, listen. Okay, what do you want to talk about? All right, well, I guess we'll go. Yeah. Serious? Hey! What do you want to talk about? I'm talking to you, too. You're talking to me. No, I'm in charge for real. here. I'm in charge here. I back the blue. Okay, I appreciate that. I really that. do. That doesn't mean you can drink and drive. No, that's absolute. Why would you back the f*** away from me? What's that? Because you're going to get gloves. We got we got work we got to do here. Yeah, whatever. Okay, relax. You need anything right now? Right this second? Do you need an address for my car? Uh, it'll get towed to the yard. We'll get, I'll let you know where it's going. What the f*** mean to the yard? To the tow yard. Impound lot. Oh, I gotta pay. Well, I'm not sure you gotta pay. You gotta pay. Sure to yeah, I'll take care hey. of it. I'll let him know. Hey, hey, Where's do my not, phone? It's in the car. Do not put your hand I need my phone thing. right now. Please. Please. Do not do that again or I'm gonna hobble you. Do you what understand do you, me? What do you mean hobble me? Do not put your head against the What are you gonna do? Throw me in jail? Yeah, we're going to jail. Holy f I mean goddamn jail! Sir! I got your wallet and your phone. No, no, no. It's, it's more important than that, sir. What's up? Look at my f***ing phone. What about your phone? My goddamn girlfriend, who's an elementary teacher, needs a f***ing ride home. Where is she? In Fort Myers at 1030, bro. Okay, well, we'll arrange that. No, you f***ing won't. Hey. I'll see you later, Sarge. Hey. Captain Fat, you think I'm <laughs> playing games? Hey, listen. She needs to pick up. Or she's gonna get fired. It's not even a f joke. She needs she needs someone to pick her up. I live with her, dude. Sir, please! Please pick her up! You're a goddamn piece of sh Ah, f my head. Listen, I love the police, but you're being f extra, bro. I don't deserve any of this. Hey, let me go, bro. Let me show you what's up. That's what I thought. He ain't gonna let me go. And I get it. I get it, Angela. Oh, I'm out. I'm out. My left hand is out. I'm loose. Oh. Yeah, you better check. You better check it out. Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm literally a fucking white guy. Why am I in trouble? Yeah, pull me in. Where are we, Alcatraz? Let me the f*** out. My girlfriend needs picking up. And can I ask you what time my girlfriend needs picking up? At the f airport? Yeah, do you want to know, you f***ing clown? 11.30. I really, I really, really respect the police. But I don't know what the f*** this is.
Oh, the door is open! Hey! Taste me, mother right. Taste me! Are you gonna calm down a little bit? Since when? Since we let you out. I've been, I've been fine since I was arrested. Okay. Technically. Alright, well I heard a lot of banging and yelling. May I get out? Slip out. Yep. What the f*** is that, an essay? This special privilege seeking male Karen was charged with DUI and resisting without violence. But when his blood alcohol content was tested, it came back at 0.248, which is over three times the legal limit in Florida. That is a crime. We're going to continue our run of male Karens because as we've seen time and again, men can be Karens too. And Karens, both male and female, think that they're above the law and this male Karen is not an exception to that rule. Male Karen is a car salesman who is test driving a car with a customer and male Karen who's driving gets pulled over for speeding. But this isn't normal speeding. Listen to how fast. This male Karen salesman was traveling in a 45 mile per hour zone. I'm stopping you as you're doing 103 miles an hour in a posted 45 mile an hour zone. Do you have your driver's license, registration, proof, insurance? Yes, I apologize, sir. I'm on the. I'm doing a test drive right now for the customer. I'm so sorry about that. Um, I'm on it. I'm on my job. I, I'm sorry, bro. Here's my information. Right here. Afternoon, Officer Gold, South Korea Police Department. The reason I'm stopping you is you're doing 103 miles an hour in a posted 45 mile an hour zone. Do you have your driver's license, registration, proof, insurance? Yes, I apologize, sir. I'm on the. I'm doing a test drive right now for the customer. I'm so sorry about that. Um, I'm on it. I'm on my job. I, I'm sorry, bro. Here's my information right here. And then let me see, let me see the company's. Um, for the company's uh, insurance. Keep working on that. Okay. Okay. It's a company, so I'm trying to look through my through my photos right now. I'm sorry. I'll call them if I have to. I just know I have the photo. Right, well, I tell you what, Mr. Gagos, I need you to step out of the car. Okay. Because right now you're under arrest for reckless driving. Really? Yeah. I apologize, sir. I'm I don't sorry. care. Get out of the car. You're under arrest. Can I call my boss to let him know? In a little bit, but not right this moment. No. I, I apologize. Stand right here. Sorry, sir. Turn around and face that direction, put your hands behind your back. Separate your feet, that's what you can do. Do you have anything sharp? I'm just going to poke your stick. Separate your feet. Wider, a little bit wider in shoulder width. There you go. Is there anything I can do, officer? I'm sorry. Like, I'm sorry, man. Nope. You are old enough to know that. 
kidding me? Howdy, partner. So the car's gonna get towed. So, uh, I mean, how old are you? All right, so, get a ride, walk it, up to you, you're free to go. You're not being held or anything at this point. All right, yeah, good luck. Have a better day. Sean, my name is Officer Golson. I'm with the Albuquerque Police Department. Um, is there a, a sales manager or somebody in a management position I can speak to about one of your vehicles? Um, no problem at all, sir. You said your name was I'm Officer Golson with APD. Okay. No problem. Um, let me see if the manager is available. Thank you. Officer, are you still there? Yep. Thank you. Hey Mike, this is Officer Golson with APD. Hey, how's it going, man? Uh, it's okay. I'm out with the uh, Damasio Gallegos and an orange Celine Mustang. And Mr. Gallegos is under arrest for reckless driving. He's doing 103 miles an hour in a 45 mile an hour zone on quarters in this vehicle. Um, I was going to tow the vehicle, however, since it still belongs to the dealership, I figured I'd give you a call, give you an opportunity to come pick it up. Wow. Um, okay, so I work for Reliable Chevy. Is that by chance? It, it might be the Nissan, yeah. Because he did have a Nismo shirt on. Yeah, it's the light of Nissan. Okay. Just, I just looked at the registration and it was this phone number that they gave me. No, I got you. I got you. Let me do this. I just... Yeah, yeah, it's my personal self, but they can call me back on this. Okay, um, give me like five minutes and I'm gonna, or five seconds, I'm gonna reach out to you. Right? Okay, appreciate it. Thanks, brother. You bet. Okay. Okay. Uh, the salesperson? Uh, uh, Masio Gallegos. Is he the only one in it? So there was somebody in the passenger seat. I didn't identify and he walked away. I don't know anybody who drives sports cars. I don't know how he got, how he got this. Thing. So, um, what, um, are we taking him in? Yeah, he's going to jail for real strike. Good. Oh, I said, hopefully, he'll probably take somebody and get some of us. I tell these guys all the time, huh? don't speed in my car. Well, I appreciate you doing this. Like yeah, I said, that's cool with you. When I saw that we still registered the dealership with the demo tag, I said, well, Especially if it's like in the process of being purchased, that'd be a yeah. Put you guys in a bad spot, the customer. Get some customers in. I guess he did have a customer who was always in. I said, some get some people that was gas. I said, what'd you buy on the side? What was he there? So, I appreciate you doing that, man. Yeah, I said, that's a customer. Uh, no, th there was somebody that was in there. I told him, I said, you call for ride or go. But oh, really? Okay. Oh, yeah. That's okay. Well, that's good. That's so, yeah. I mean, the guy looked really young. Uh, he was like, he almost looked like he was in a cannon. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's what I said, yeah. Well, he bought his dash pad now, so I bet he... Yeah, he said he was test driving it for a customer. Yeah. I was a customer, and I found out that somebody was driving yeah. a car like that that I was supposed to be buying. Mm -hmm. He's got 103 on it. 
schools. Okay, so what? he's gonna have to deal with that now, but I figured I'd like, just give you guys the opportunity to get more back. Yeah, yeah, especially if it's in transaction. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, good. that's good. That's good. Yeah, so that's a solid one. I appreciate it. Yeah, no what problem. about him? Uh, so he's gonna jump. Okay. All right. So then we'll have his phone and we'll call you guys whenever. Nobody gets hurt. You know what I mean? Use it as a learning lesson to move on. As opposed to me having to charge with great bodily harm by vehicle or you know, harm by vehicle. So, because that I do a lot. I have to see one of those bitches. Give me a minute. Test drive or not, after driving 103 miles per hour in a 45 mile per hour zone, male Karen was cited for reckless driving and as you saw, was taken to jail. But to make matters worse for him, the car dealership had to come and pick up that car so it didn't get towed. So if I were a betting man, I would bet that this was male Karen's last day at this job. I'm rich. I'm giving away my car, so I will walk. Do you want this to go viral or not? Because your name is going to be all over the goddamn social media. Susan. Up next is the story of a 54-year-old Karen who was kicked out of not one, not two, but three hotels on October 5th of 2021 due to her aggressive behavior towards the staff. It is suspected that her actions were influenced by alcohol or something else. Now, the police officers are questioning the hotel staff to unravel the events and understand the situation, and that's where we pick up our action. What's going on? I'm part of the beach. I just got here at 12. Um, apparently, the second shift. Oh my god! I don't keep that in three hotels! Go ahead, I don't care. Don't bother me. So what's going on now? Right. Okay. I got here for that second shift said that she has been very out of it. Uh, she's left her keys, her cell phone up here. Uh, she came in to use the restroom. She was calm. I had a black man that was getting water. She told me, told me to give him a room. I said, what's in the room? She looked at him and said, well, you better f***ing stay in the goddamn room. I said, you're not going to talk to my guests like that. So then she brings her stuff in. I asked her, I said, you know, do you got a room? And she said, yes. And I said, okay, well, make sure you take your stuff up there. And she looked at me and said, why the f are you telling me that? And I put my stuff up there. You're not going to talk to me like that, I'm telling you. She goes back outside. I wouldn't let her in because you got to use your room key first off. Okay. She just, I talked to second shift. She needs to go. If it's refunding her money, whatever. Okay. But when I talked to dispatch, she acted like she, apparently she had problems with her tonight. Yeah, we've already had it. Okay. I recorded her yelling at me and cussing at me through the speaker. Okay. Uh, so, if I charged her with disorderly conduct, mm -hmm. is it something that you'd be willing to testify to? Yeah, I want to go. If you had whatever. to. They will not leave, let me in the room and I paid for it. And this is third hotel I've been to today. I'm asking for someone to please let me in the room. This is not a big thing. Okay. Well, hold on. Well, hold on. My, my partner's in there talking to him. Here, Just hold tight. I have no guns. Okay. So you either do it or me. Because I don't give a Do what? My car is right out there. You can have it. Okay. Well, I'll go homeless. Do you see the guy on my feet? Well, why I'm would rich. You go home? Why would you, you go homeless? Me? Because I live with a drunken asshole. So I'm if sorry I don't make that. myself clear that I had to escape from Florida to Georgia, I don't know what else I can do. As yet, you escort me out of the room. Now, I'm giving well, away my car, so I will walk. So why I make you? myself clear. Yes, ma'am. Susan, why would you want to walk? Oh my God, 
seriously, how many times? My daughter lives Susan. with a mental health condition. I know, you told, you told me then that before. What the why do I have to go into this? Do you want this to go viral or not? Because your name is going to be all over the goddamn social media. Susan. Okay. Susan, just Thank sit down for a minute, okay? So what can I do to help you tonight? You need a place to stay? I, need, I already paid for a place to stay. This is my third. Your third? Well, I've seen you three times. And then I'm coming over here because I still don't feel quite respected in a southern kind of hospitality way. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Me too, because I'm a Christian lady, and I don't quite understand what the f*** is going on. Okay. Because I okay. don't know if there's a virus, because I've been on the side of a goddamn mountain. Yes, ma'am. What's that for? So get her out of my way, or I'm going to buy this f***ing chain. Okay. Do I make myself clear? I'm right. a millionaire. You All call right. my parents. 407. Do I need to go further, sir? As Karen proudly flaunted her alleged millionaire status and confidently declared her intention to purchase the hotel chain, little did Karen know that the officers inside were already preparing to apprehend her. Moments later, they emerged and escorted her into custody. Consequently, this Karen found herself charged with public intoxication, disorderly conduct, and possession of a Schedule 1 controlled substance, which explains why she got kicked out of three hotels. You're under arrest. Stop! I didn't do anything! I can't breathe! Please, sir, believe me! Oh, I wasn't resisting. On the evening of December 18th of 2022, law enforcement was alerted to an ongoing shoplifting incident. Upon reaching the location, officers encountered a known 27-year-old Karen in the parking lot and took immediate action. Stop! I said stop! You're under arrest! Stop! Video got one running. I said stop! Or it's gonna be you! Do it one running! Get on the ground. I didn't do anything. Go over and stop. Oh, I didn't do anything. Oh. Get on your Please stomach. Have to be on your back. Sir. Oh. Please, you're hurting Dude, me. Dude, I need him over here, Joanne. I can't breathe. I swear to God, I can't. I'm on. I'm on. Oh, I'm calm. Stop resisting. I'm calm. Stop resisting. Get on your stomach. Get on your stomach. Got him fighting. No, I'm not fighting. I swear. Sorry. You're on your stomach. Resisting. Oh. 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 I can't breathe. Just get to put your other hand behind your back, please, okay? Oh. Can you please just help me get off my back? We will in a second once you get your other hand behind your back, okay? My hands behind my back. Keep your other one underneath oh, your belly. Breathe. Okay? I can't breathe. We'll get there in a second. I can't breathe. Look, help. Please get off my back. I got it. I got it. Oh. I can't breathe. Oh, oh, please get off my back. Please get off my back. Please. I'm begging you. Okay, I'm going to let your feet go. Just go on your side, please. okay? And we're going to patch please. you down. There you go. Please. There you go. Oh my God. Here you take over. I can't breathe. Yep. I wasn't trying to fight you. I couldn't breathe. I swear to God. Oh my God. I couldn't breathe. Oh. Sorry about that. I thought they were on that side because all I three saw of them. somebody running. Yeah, that's why I came that way because there was two people standing there. Uh, okay, ready to stand up? Yeah. Let's take her I wasn't, in my car now. Uh, yeah. All I wasn't resisting. I wasn't trying to stand up. Cool. Yeah. Can you stand up? I apologize. Oh, I couldn't breathe. Just to let you know, you are being audio and video recorded right now. Okay? I, I wasn't resisting your eyes. I couldn't breathe. Okay. You're fine. So you are, you are being audio and video recorded. Okay. Stand around. Is the simmer on? Oh, that makes sense. Needles or anything in your pockets? Simmer on. No. Simmer on? Bell Fuchs. Yeah, I didn't recognize you. Hello. 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 Hello
Are you okay? Are you hurt yeah. or anything? It's a hard to breathe right now. Yeah, just from running? No. Okay. Hey, I, I just want to let you know you're being audio and video recorded. Did I tell you that? Yeah. Okay. So right yeah, now you're being audio, audio and video recorded. You have a car somewhere? You have a car somewhere that we need? Resisting. You have a car somewhere? Okay. It's okay. You, you have a car nearby? No? Okay. So other than the hard to breathe thing, anything else injuring you right now or? My ribs. Okay. So My ribs hurt. Ribs hurt. I wasn't trying to. Now, now Ronnie, I, I'm I, not. I'm okay. not kidding. Ronnie, I'm not I, 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 we, we know about you. I, I've dealt with I you a know, lot of times in the past. I know, and I'm not this is lying. a standard behavior for you, right? Like no. you always run. Okay, so but I, that's not what <laughs> that's not what I'm here for. Okay, I'm not here to talk about that. When, once sorry. we're done, I'll, I'll I'll get with you. I'm going to talk to you about what happened and what the officers' actions were and everything like that. My job is to like Ow. figure out what happened. Okay, Hi. so we'll go from there. Down here. Be careful. Okay, we'll My calf. Oh, yeah. I apologize. Well, you're under arrest for theft. Don't know what level yet because those jeans are expensive. Two, oh. resistant arrest, and three, obstructing. You have a right to turn if you can afford to want to be appointed to. You understand that? Where are you taking me to? Right here to the back of this car right now. What's wrong with your calf? <laughs> when, Just from running? No, when he got on top of me. Okay. He was uh, on my rib cage. And then, uh, okay. I, he was ahead of his knee in my calf. Okay. Where's this car at? Uh, hmm? Where's this car at? At home. At home? Where's home? Let me see. Okay, I'll go find it. All right, Ronnie. So, like I said, I'm I'm here to investigate the use of force. Can you kind of walk me through like what happened? I don't care about that other stuff. Officer contacted you over here. What what happened? Well, when the the officer approached, he pulled up in in his car, and the people kept chasing after me. And they okay. kept bumping into me. Okay. And then, and then he like he was like, "Hey, stop!" And, and, and what did you do when he said stop? I just kept walking. Which way did you? You were walking. walking and then I, and then you were I walking started, towards Eddie Bauer, and when right, he said stop, you started running this way. He, yeah, he pulled something out, and I didn't know if it was. His what, what did you mean? He put, or a gun. Okay. So I got scared. Okay, so you took off running. Yeah. Okay, and like you, you took you, you ran over here. That's about. You know, 50 yards or so. What happened uh, when you guys got over here? When he got over here, he snatched me okay. by my neck. He, like when you say he snatched you by your neck, like he like grabbed he you? Grabbed he grabbed you on the, Okay. Arm, he grabbed you by, by your arm neck, and your neck? And okay. By my neck. And then he's like, get down on the ground. And then he put his, his foot on my calf. Okay. And then he pushed me to the ground and I hit my chest. And okay. His knee. Usually that would be the, the normal procedure, but his he, knee went on your back. Me. He's he went in my ribs and on my back, and I kept trying to tell him, and he said that I was resisting, but I wasn't trying. But when I walked resist. up, you were still kind of squirming around I on him. I couldn't breathe. But you were squirming I, I, around on him. All I, you had to do was I, lay on your stomach. And I couldn't breathe with okay. his knee like, okay. on my back. I wasn't okay. trying to resist. Okay. Okay. I kept trying to show my hand. Knee, knee on back and rib. In my ribs. On, on, so on the side, on like the on ground. On my side, like it was. Okay. It was you were pinching. on your side. Okay. He was pinching me, and so I kept trying to tell him, "Sir, I can't breathe. I can't okay. breathe. I'm not resisting." I showed okay. him my hands, and I put them up, and he just kept pressing like harder, like all his weight, like he's bigger than me, like I'm yeah. not going anywhere. Okay. He's on top of me. Okay. So. Uh, so your ankle is bothering you, but is it like you, my calf, you, you can my walk? Calf you can hurts. walk just fine. Walk. You can walk just fine. And my then you hurt. said your ribs are sore, but like like sore, like like it like just bruised a little bit. Was on. Okay, okay. Do you need medical attention? I guess is, do you need medical attention? Is what I'm asking you. Like, do you think you're gonna be all right once you calm down a little bit? I would like medical attention. And what what does that look like? Like, do you you want to like just some firefighters to come out here and look at you real quick? Is that is I don't, it, like, I don't think that'll suffice? What it is. Okay. I hope so because it really hurts to breathe. Okay. Okay. Um, you guys are employees, not loss prevention. Right. right. So just make sure that you have selection, concealment, constant observation, passing all points of pain, leave the store. Make sense? 
What is that? No. So when she concealed it, it was in the dressing room when she left the store and either time and then the video recording of her leaving the store? <laughs> no, no, no. Just basically a female later ID by the police. Got it. Uh, came into go. the store, selected merchandise, okay. went into the dressing room, came out without merchandise, which... Right, right. Did somebody check the dressing room? I ran into the dressing room oh, and she was walking there. out. Well, there was plenty of other stuff in there. She took like I, a fat <laughs> amount. I knew of that there was just be as there. just be as articulate yeah. as you can. Gotcha. Just remember, um, selection, concealment. Obviously, you don't have constant observation because she went into a dressing room. Right, right. Can I right. tell? Do I put in there that I asked her? multiple times to just give us our product back walking Absolutely. out of the store. I did too. Even I just said, ma'am, give us our product. Ma'am, give us our product. Yeah, I, I told her, I said, if you just give me my stuff back, I'll Yeah, just be as articulate as you possibly okay. can. So no scratches or anything on you? No knee scuffs up or anything? On oh, my left knee. Your left knee? Hurts. Okay. What? I'll probably, my once hand. you figure out what's happening with you, I'll get some pictures and stuff and then we'll go from there, okay? Okay. Any questions for me? Um, I have a I have a puppy at home. Okay. If I'm going to be taken to jail, can I please make a phone call? You'll, when folks? you get there, you'll be able to call folks. Yep. Uh, yep. The, you, you've been there before. You know how it works. Which? Where am I going? I don't know right now. We got to figure that out. We got to f see how much uh, merchandise you took, and if it's over, you know, a felony amount, which is only seven hundred fifty dollars, which I, you might have might have gone over that. I didn't. Uh, go you'll over have you'll that. have to go to county jail, um, and they'll hold on to you. But um, you will most likely, I think, go to city jail. Um, well, they, they're, depending on their population status, they'll either get you an admin booked and kick you out, or they'll hold you for the night, but you can, you'll, they'll let you get a phone call out. Okay? So I'm going to close the door for you, um, and then let you warm up for a little bit, and we'll go from there, okay? Okay. Okay, step on out. I really am sorry for trying to roll over. I couldn't breathe. <laughs> <laughs> Summer on it would have been simple for you just to stop when I told you to stop. You probably wouldn't have been in this position. You don't have any warrants or anything else. You created this problem. And I apologize. I didn't lie about anything, Cimarron. You're the like I said before, you're the one who brought yourself on this. You told the doctor you took it as soon as you got in the back of the patrol car, and I said that couldn't happen. Absolutely. No, it's not impossible. I can reach my mouth. I don't know why you guys don't think I showed you I could. Like, look at me. I, I know you probably could. There's no reason for me to not. Okay. <laughs> they didn't know anything. So watch your step going down before you step up inside there. Well, the Karen with the sticky fingers who claimed that she didn't do anything and that she couldn't breathe, which she did and she could, was apprehended on suspicion of evading arrest, obstructing a law enforcement officer, and committing third degree theft after failing to appear. Sir, sir, it's time to go. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. You called me. I look like a man. Yes. He hit the door frame when we went to the ground. I'm going to check that out. Maybe then, look at your thing. You want put your Put your feet in. Back on October 26th of 2022, an unsettling scene played out at the Comfort Inn on Chateau Drive in Rome, Georgia. More specifically, a 27-year-old male Karen, visibly intoxicated and accompanied by his family, created a tumultuous situation. Male Karen reportedly made threats to other guests as well as hotel staff and caused the disruption in the vicinity of the hotel swimming pool. The tension heightened as male Karen continued to use offensive language, all while his mother, who is also a Karen, was present at the hotel. But the arrival of deputies added an element of anticipation that we are about to witness firsthand. Hello. So you missed the uh, round two, I guess it was. The other. Um, so the gentleman Do they leave or they're still here? The gentleman in question that I have the issue with is drunk off his mind. Mm -hmm. He's been in the pool room with his mother and another gentleman for an hour and a half. I talked to them earlier, so they had to get themselves together and get gone. 
They did not. And he was passed out on the floor. They've had multiple family members come and try to get him up and get him out. And right now, he's still currently threatening another guest through the door in my pool room. Through, I, what, through what door? Through the pool room door. The door that uh, disconnects the pool to the walk-in area. Okay. Um, he's up against the glass talking to this guest. Okay, where's the pool at? So, uh, all the way straight back. Well, he needs to go. The whole family needs to go. So you want you want him and anybody he came here with yes, to leave? Yes, everyone in room. Okay, all right. Oh, right there, there. That's where we're going. That's where we're going. Well, I'm not going there yet, but. Oh, I'm trying to locate the. All right, all right. It's time to go. Her face. Sir, sir, sir. It's time to go. Do you understand? Do you understand? Stop. I'm gonna take you to jail, sir. You understand? Sir. Look I don't care what she's doing. Please look at her face. Let's go to your room and we're leaving. Please look at her face. Turn around and start walking. Sir, will you please look at her face? Turn around and start walking. Will you please look at her face? I don't care what she's doing. Go. She is me. You're staying in 115. Let's go. Can I, can I leave Let's go. She is going to leave. Look at her face. I don't care. Go. But why don't you care about her Go. Face? Because I'm concerned about you right now. Go. But she has been in. Do you hear what I'm telling you? I do, sir. Go to 115. Okay. Now. Please. Go to 115. One I don't care to hear what you got to say. Go. So why don't you care about what she said? Because I don't care to hear what you got to say. I'll talk to her in a minute. Right now I'm dealing with you. But you understand? You don't care about what she says, though. You're staying at 115, correct? No, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave and I'm going to walk back to You're staying at 115, I'm correct? Walk back to All right. No, you're not going to go anywhere right now. Why are you? Why are you, why are you grabbing my help? Sir, I'm sister. about to take you to the ground and you're going to go in handcuffs. Do you Sir, understand me? I promise he doesn't I just mean said I... Do you understand? understand? Did I, I have enough you against understand? you right now to take you to jail for public drunk and disorderly conduct. Just said I, I will put you on the ground and put you in handcuffs. Do you understand? Do you understand? Do you understand? Don't say you I understand. do, but I said I would walk back to the car to be taken. No, back. I'm going to make sure that you get with folks. It's going to make sure you need to go where you. What? I'm not Mommy, talking about that. Mom, stop! Or I'm going to put no, you on the ground. I just. No, I'm going to put you. Get on the ground. 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 Did I? Get on the ground. Or I'm going to tase you, Mom. Do you understand, Mom? Get on the ground now. Put your hands behind your back now. I'm about to tase you. Do you understand? I'm about to tase you. Do you understand? Put your hands behind your back now. Do you understand? What will I go to Dalton, Georgia for? 61 dispatch. I got one on the ground. What will I go to Who's close to me? Put your hands behind your back now. I'm trying to get him there. Give me that other hand. I just said I would go to jail. When you get asked to do something, you do it. I just said I would go to my room. No. I just said I would go to my room. I tried to be. What did I do to you? We're done talking. We are. What did I do to you? I didn't do anything. Will you grab his watch? We get her to come out and get this watch. You got anything on? Stand up. Stand up. I have a. I have a surgery. Stand up. My shoulder. Stand I've up. had three surgeries on my stand shoulder. Up. Please. Please. Get on your knees. Stand up. Please. Ah. Stand up. There you go. Ah. You good? Stand up. Now stand up. Stand up. There you go. Let's go. Please. We're good. I don't know what that's about. We'll figure it out. Let's just go. No. Let's get him in the car right quick. No. Okay. 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 I really don't want to because I'm so shaky, but I promise you won't cause any problems between that we don't ever. I listen, 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 it's not up to me. Nice. Hang tight. And just be available when I come back. Alright. Um, so we need to leave now? Oh, we're going to figure that out. Can you get the table on the desk and get the truck on the desk? Can you sleep, Mom? Can you sleep? Can you sleep? Can you sleep? Can you sleep? No. Well, we'll figure it out. I'm so sorry. I don't need to. Seven on the desk. Where are you from? Which part is this supposed to be? I'm from Georgia, but I live in Gainesville. Okay.
department case, okay. King uh, who's, who's down here that's related or something um, to this? I don't know so, if my mother went down there, but it's my mother. Is that the one? Okay, do you know what room she's Sorry in? Sorry about that. It's going to be oh, above me, but I believe it's going to be Kate okay. King uh, But she's not in she's there. Not she's up here somewhere. Okay. Simple. Okay. We'll so try to figure out. Is she hiding in another room? Is that no. what she's doing? She wouldn't be hiding. She might be in there. She's in the pool or the bathroom. Okay. She might be having a panic attack because of the way her son's out. Right. We'll, we'll, we'll get to the bottom of it. Just look, give me a few minutes. Back. I've never, ever, ever. Stop. I, I'm not going to let you fall, but walk. Sir, can I pull my pants up? Stop. Please, go away. Now walk. Been, I've never even been given a ticket. Well, today's the day. Never, you should have done well, what I asked you to do. I did. No, you weren't. What did I do? No, you weren't. What did I do that, no, I weren't? Please, God Almighty, I will leave right, I will go to sleep right now. I was trying to give you that opportunity. I did. You didn't want to take it. Sir. Now that opportunity's gone. Oh, okay. Stop. You're going in the back of this car. Do you understand me? Sir. Do you understand what I'm telling you? Are falling down. Pull your britches up. Sir, I have <laughs> Pull your britches up. There. Our pool closes at 10. Gets out. I go back there and tell him the pool's closed for cleaning because we can't close it at night. And the mother, he's up on the door like this. I mean, clearly too drunk for his own for the good. Pool, in the pool room? In the pool room. I couldn't even get the door open for at least three minutes. And she was trying to get him off the door and couldn't. He's way bigger than she is. Right. So, nicely, I said, y'all have to get it all together and get gone. Because the other dude that was with them was clearly drunk too. I don't know where he went or anything, but that one there has been stuck in the pool for over two, like about two hours now. A co-worker went back there to try to get him off the floor to help the, the young lady that was at the door that you just spoke to. Went back there to help her get him up. They got him standing up. He still wouldn't leave. He still wouldn't move. Another guest had come in to help the situation. Still wouldn't leave. Still wouldn't move. I go back there, and as soon as I go back there, he's like, why is this lady in my face? I said, sir, I work here. He said, you ugly bitch, I wasn't talking to you. Automatically, I'm not having it. He called me out my name multiple times, called me uh, a dick, a land, I look like a man, foaming at the mouth. Yeah, I saw that. Clearly drunk, and I told him, now he has to go. I gave him the choice to leave okay. or get it together. Y'all you, you want to talk to mom? Yeah. Well, do what I'm asking you to do. And I want, you know, nobody wouldn't have to take you to the can ground. Please, can I please pull But I'm not going to. Back up. Pull them up. Please look in the vents. They're pulled do? up. I'm trying to there. do what I'm trying Sit to down. do. Sit down. I am doing this. Let me see your face because when we turn, I you have, get the door. I have never, I have never even been arrested right, for a ticket. put your knees in. Put your knees in. I have never been arrested for a ticket. Put your knees in. We were going to Jelly Roll today. Give me a second. We'll talk again in a second. Please, Relax. Sir. Well, you got too drunk tonight, and you're doing a lot of stuff before I got here. And then when I tried to get you to go to the room, I was going to get everybody had to be, was going to be told they had to leave. You insisted you was going to walk to Dalton. You didn't want me to have a hold of you, and I wasn't going to let you go where you wanted to. And then when you jerked from me, that's when you go to the ground. I'm not going to fight you standing up. And then when we got to the ground, you still resisted me. I had to take my taser out and threaten you with that before you would fully put your hands behind your back. Notice I didn't even use it on you. I could have. The moral to the story is when a police officer asks you to do something, you do it. That's plain and simple. You do what we ask you to do. All right, give me a few minutes. Give me a few minutes. Yeah, where is it uh, Probably in a patrol car. Can I speak to him? Not right now. Let us figure this stuff out before. This child just graduated college business two majors and a minor. I know he's 25, well, 27. It's a little old to be graduating with two majors and a minor, but I don't have two majors and a minor, do you? Mm -hmm. um, I don't have two majors and a minor. Okay, what, what do you, did you have something to say to us? Well, How yeah, are you involved? I have to say you this. How are you involved with this, Jill? She's I a mother. Son. Okay. That's all that I have to say, and I have to say this. I'm a grandmother. I don't care what you have and what I don't have. Who was the other lady on the other side of the glass? That he was, no, the other lady that was on the other side of the glass inside the pool room. Who was that? 
Let's try to locate her because she was scared to even come on this side of that door against him, and he was. No. Yeah. Okay. Can we go back in here? Your son is going to jail for separate, separate instances that occurred in the hallway on top of other things. Well, that don't mean that he can't get into trouble. He's in trouble tonight. Disorderly conduct and public drunk and obstruction. Yeah, and he obstructed me from doing my, my job. I had to bring your son to the ground. And then threaten him with my taser before he would before he would put his hands behind his back. He's that drunk. Okay, okay. But listen, I'm not going to have any discussions about your education. I will talk to you about anything. I don't care if you went to Harvard. Your your, your education has nothing nothing to do with this. I will talk to you about your son, and that's it. Yes, he did. Okay, that has nothing to do with this. Well, I don't care. Well, he wasn't displaying that he knew it then. Yes, ma'am. My effort, my effort, when I made contact with your son in that room with you, with you in that room, was to get him and separate him from that. Then the management wants everybody in 115 to include him to leave the property. I was trying to get him into that room, make contact with somebody that was sober, so we could do that. Your son insisted he's going to walk to Dalton. I'm not going to let that happen. I told him several times we're not going to do it. He wanted to, he didn't want me to have a hold of him. When I said, no, I'm not letting go of you, he jerked for me. That's when we went to the ground. And when we went to the ground, he still, yes, he's got a, he's got a place on his face and we'll do If he would have done what he asked, if I asked him, if he would have done what I asked him to do, he wouldn't be where he's at. Okay, you need to go to your room. We're done talking. So, they seem pretty calm, other than him, which he's yeah. not going to be a problem the rest of the night. Um, I don't know about her. I want her gone too. She sat here and threatened my job and threatened to sue and threatened this and threatened that. She can get gone too. I see where she, he gets it from. Clear yeah. as day. And she's slurring, so she can say she's not drunk. Oh, yeah, she's she intoxicated. Is. She's under the influence of something. Exactly. And here's the thing. My GM was on the phone while she was talking all over her mess, and my GM told her that everyone will have to go because he's done put everyone in danger in this hotel. The fact that me and her had to sit there, and I felt like I was going to have to fight this dude. I really did. She did nothing to ease the situation because he could she could she can't. Your own full yeah. officer had to put so Where's much force in to get him down. She can't do nothing. No. She couldn't do she nothing. She wasn't willing to do anything. Uh, exactly. Uh, I want her gone. Now, look, if it was up to me, I would let them stay. But letting them stay causes the chance of them coming back in because not everyone is going to know that they don't belong here. Well, well they're only here for one night, so they leave tomorrow. So then them the only, two can get gone. I, can, I can't stop you from getting any of them gone. But they do have a baby in there, and that's what concerns me. I know, and I feel that, and I understand that. But my oh. GM said that everyone had to leave. Okay, okay, ma'am. You're. Uh, so my son is it, uh, assisted. Uh, he resisted arrest. Uh -huh. he, he was thrown to the ground, and his face is. Okay, uh, Grover. Management has requested she leave. Yeah. But when we spun and went to the ground, he hit the door front. Okay. And we went down, so we'll address that in a minute. Yeah. But he's sitting back here to make sure you don't pass out, please. Yes, sir. I'll get with her. I'll go to 115. Did we locate and figure well, out who that other lady was? In the, the behind yeah, because he had her ass in there. She didn't want to come out. Uh, I think that was, she said it was just a passerby, somebody was coming and trying she, to help. Yeah, and he, he had her, he was in that room, the glass room, prior to the <laughs> pool room, and he was yelling and cussing at her and giving her everything she could, she could get. Well, I think... I've, I've been talking to her. The girl in there, her, his sister. Yeah. She seems calm. She hadn't been drinking. Yeah. Her husband, I think, has, mm -hmm. but they got a baby. 
Yeah. So yeah, I think I, I think the man I think management because the GM said that all of them have to. All of them have to. Yeah. But I think she's going to call her back, call the GM back, and see if they can at least okay. stay. She just going okay. to. Just keep checking yep. on him. I'll deal with this right here. Yes, sir. All right, ma'am. It's time for you guys to go. Okay, I'm about to make contact with your daughter. They have an infant child inside there, and her husband. Management wants you guys to leave the premises. Okay. So we need to get up, and we need to do that. Ma'am, I'm not going to discuss your no, son's yeah. arrest right now. This is a separate deal now. Oh, yes. It's they want you to go. Paid $200 that does not matter. That's a civil arrangement that you can have a discussion with them on another day. Not today. So what I need you to do is get up out of your seat. I'm sorry, but that's what they want. So I need you to get out of your seat and come with me to 115, and you guys have to leave the property. That's something that you're going to have to deal with. You live in Dalton. It's not that far. Okay? No, they live in Gainesville. Okay, a Gainesville's far. not that far away. So I need you to get up out of your seat. Okay, you're out here with no shoes on. You're intoxicated. No, I'm not intoxicated. Yes, you are. I need you to stand up and let's go to 115. I need you to stand up. We're going to 115 and we're going to leave. Sir. I'm not, ma'am. I'm going to put you in handcuffs and I'll take you to jail with your son. Do you understand? Is that what you want me to do? No. Then stand up. That's all I'm asking you to do. These are simple instructions. And I'm trying to be as nice as I can be. Now stand up. Let's go back to your room. And we'll get ready to get out of here. Do you work here? I do. You weren't the one on the other side of the glass, were you? Yes. Okay, give me just a second. Ma'am. Unfortunately, due to the chain of events and the decisions your brother made, y'all have to go. She said that me and my husband and her could stay. Right. Now that's now the general manager has been contacted, and they want everybody to go. Okay, so your mom's into your mom's intoxicated. I think your husband possibly is. I've not seen him. I'm not a He's drinking. He's right. I hate that you have a child with you. I hate that I had to take you to the ground like that in front of you. But I'm not going to fight somebody standing up. So, I hate that, yeah. but unfortunately, they do want you guys to go. All right, so okay? we did contact the GM again, and she said that her, the baby, and the husband had stayed. Okay, then. Then retort what because I just said. But your mother has to go. <laughs> who can come get her? No, I'm going to have to go then, because there's no one who can come get her. Nope, she, she knows absolutely nobody. No friends, family, sister, brother, aunt, uncle, nobody that can come get her. It would be it's, a long drive. From my, where? My sister and Caleb could come get her. Uh, well, let's go ahead and call them. Okay. If you guys are okay, would you guys be okay with that? If with her just, waiting until this other person call, comes? Call, I'll leave um, right in here. I'm not the only clock, clock employee, so I'm not going to Go speak. ask, yeah, go no, ask I'm her. I'm employee or to the gym. My, I know my mother. She will not. She'll stay right in here. Okay, I then. Uh, and if well, you wanted to stay, make sure. Well, we'll we can't stay that long. Until okay, let, people, me, let me call so, them. So call them and let's see, okay? Right, you can shut your door, okay? I'll, I'll be back in just a second. So I, I told the, the young girl the, that her and her baby and her, all of them had to go. Okay, but I then, spoke, yeah. Um, I was on the phone with my GM while you were dealing with her, mm -hmm. and then, of course, they okay. walked up. I went back there and notified her that... Her, the baby, and her husband yeah. can stay. Yeah. But the mother and the son have yeah. The problem with the mama is not that, that we can't facilitate her leaving. Apparently, they're all the way from Gainesville. Some of them live in Dalton, some of them live in Gainesville. Her daughter is calling, I guess, her mom's sister and someone else to come get her. Are y'all okay with waiting? No, I want her off property because okay. if she's going to continue to be a problem thing, at all, yeah. she can sit out outside i'm sorry but i know i understand i'm just asking and that's perfectly yeah, I, fine I the son obviously is going to jail okay. do you mind if i get your information no not at all because um, you're the one that called and you got to you got to witness what happened in the hallway yeah, unfortunately uh, do you mind if i get your driver's license sure. now you were the one on the other side of the glass correct yeah, so what went on there? Was he keeping you in there? Were you afraid to come outside? I mean, what, he was, what was because he was so aggressive. He was banging on the glass door so hard. We thought that he was about to break the pool door. Ma'am, get, you get in your room. Get in your room. I me, will in a minute. Thanks. Go in your room. I'm not going right there. You, I'm, I'm not please. going there right this second. I'll no, be there in a minute. I need you to explain to my daughter that it's not only <laughs> me 
Step but we're not concerned about that her. right now. No, she Go is. to the room. No, she's concerned. And I'll come down there and talk to, to y'all in just a second. She's telling my, her, her I'm daughter, not going to get her. involved in all that. Go hey, to your room. For Jesus Christ. Go to your room. I'm going to take you to jail. Oh, man. It's a wonder we have any patience whatsoever. Mm. Oh, you know what God's gift to earth, I swear. I'm telling you. Because I could not. <laughs> so you got involved because you're an employee here, and yeah, so so I'm a, on a, on site employee. Okay. So I'm not on the clock, but yep. we I went down there to try to because we watched him for almost an hour. Mm -hmm. They were fondling with him. He, he was laying in front of the pool door. So I went down there to try to help them see if I can ease he ease him off the ground and get him because you know they're the right on the first floor to try to get him to the room. And then for, for, for a little bit, he was in and out of it. Mm -hmm. he, he started throwing all kinds of craziness around. And, and I, I well, just, did he ever try to break anything, throw anything? Was it all just... He, he was banging on the glass so hard yeah, that glass, I thought sure. he was about to break the glass door of the pool area. Is there another exit out of that pool or is that the only way out? There is another exit. Um, but we can't... Checks, there's like two other ones, but you have to go outside. So you um, can't get out from the room that you were in, the pool room, you can't get out in any other way. Outside, like okay. outside of the property. But we didn't um, want him back in the pool No, area. no, I got you. I just want to make sure that you had another way out. Yeah, and that you yeah, we, we definitely had another because way out. Because then that gets into a, yeah. a whole other thing. Okay. Exactly. So like we, we, de we well, definitely didn't hold us yeah, hostage. Because yeah. yeah. I even went outside, smoked a cigarette, and came back yes. to just to make sure he wasn't breaking yes, the door or the glass or, or, or jumping back in the pool or jumping back, back in the pool, pool fully, fully closed or yep. whatever so while he was doing all that out there did he make any kind of real threats towards you or did you feel just threatened by his actions it was more of his actions okay. the, the words that were coming out of his mouth were so vulgar and yeah. in, incoherent that mm -hmm. we knew that he was just too drunk and so we were just like yes, can you please just go back to your room yes ma'am i'm oh, telling you anytime i start talking about oh. alcohol and people I eat my words. I was just having a conversation at the jail that that uh, folks that get to the point to where he's at, um, they're hard to deal with. You can't deal with them. And we, we were hoping that we would just, Dang it. that he was so drunk that we could just guide him back to the room. Yeah, that's and that he wouldn't turn on him. Because I was even telling the sister, because once he started yelling the profanity, he's all, I backed up because I was like, all right, I'm aggravating it. So I'm going to back away. I'm not going to touch him. Because I didn't want him to turn the way he did. No, you did good. I mean, he may not have been he, the same he, he wouldn't walk. You had to drag him. Mm -hmm. You had to bump him to force him to even move. All right. I think I get everything I need. I'm gonna go make contact with mom and advise her that she needs to go. Yeah. I can tell her she can get a she can get a taxi and do something, but we'll see how that goes. The bottom of the hill for all I, care. I understand. I'll let her know, okay, and I'll and I'll let them know. Once we remove him, obviously he ain't gonna be able to come back up here tonight for a while. Um, even if somebody wants to bail him out, they'll let him have, have to sober up. Um, now, her, if she doesn't end up going to jail, she could make make her way back up here. I don't know. If she does, just call us back, and there won't be no hesitation. We'll take her, okay? I'll be right back, okay? How's it going? Good. Pretty good. So I'm on the phone with another hotel room right now. Okay. So, ma'am, I need you to step out here with me. For a I'm sorry. They, they want you gone immediately. We're, so we're if you, going to go with the we get our child? So, you, so you, you're choosing to leave too? Yeah, we are. We are choosing to leave. No, I understand. I understand. Okay. All right, then. So I'll let them know that you guys. Are. All right. So, we'll, we're, so, so what's going to happen is your son's going to jail. First, I'm going to take him to the hospital and have his eye checked out. Wait, then we'll, wait, then wait, we'll take wait, him to jail. What? Listen. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm checked out. Yes. No, he no, hit no, the door frame when we went to the ground. I'm going to have him checked out medically clear. Then we're going to go to jail. I'm gonna leave you guys oh, with so it. Sorry, she needs it. she needs to leave. Can you, okay, can with you. you. Because if leaving. we if we come back up here and she's doing any of this, and no, no, I mean this. You just made okay. me. You just told me okay. my son's eye has to yes, be checked out. Step in the room, please. Oh man, I don't even think these people ever made it. I think their intent was to go, but I don't think they made it. To be honest with you. All right, they are packing their stuff up and leaving. I would stay up here if we had plenty of time. But I'm in the sakes of trying to get him to the hospital, get him yeah. taken care of, by all means. If she comes out here giving you any trouble or anything like that, here's your other slip paper. Call us back. We'll, oh. I mean, we'll respond. We'll make it work. Um, but her daughter's sober. She's on the phone trying to find another room. I, I assume that in the end that they'll just leave and go home. Okay. Um, 
because her daughter doesn't want to leave her. And I get that. I mean, yeah, she doesn't want because her mom, that. her mom's probably not going to, she leaves her somewhere. She's probably not going to be able to control herself. So I understand that part. So, but from now until the time they leave, if they give you any trouble, just call us back. Are you going to be up here the rest of the night? Yeah. Okay. Call us back and we'll come back. Okay. You need anything else from us? Thank you so much. Okay. Yes, ma'am. All right. The daughter and the husband that's intoxicated and the baby were allowed to stay, but she doesn't want to leave her mom, which I get. And they all live in Gainesville, Dalton, and so now they're all leaving. The daughter's choosing to go. So I'm going to take Ken to Floyd, have his face checked out. I ain't going to lie, he hit it pretty hard. But in the confines of that small space for me to spin him and put him to the ground, I only did what I could do. I didn't fight a, I wouldn't have... I wouldn't have done that purposely, but that's just, unfortunately, that's what happened. Uh, so I'll take him, make sure he's good. Yeah. Do you want Do you want to get a seat belt from this side for me? Okay. All right, sir. We're going to put your seat belt on, okay? I've, I've never, could I, could I have a second? I've never been arrested. Well, that has no bearing on what's what going on right now. Disorderly conduct, public intoxication, and obstruction. That's public your charge that I told you earlier. Yes, sir. You didn't tell me, what have I done? I've, I've already told you times before now. I've sat in this car. Okay. How can you give me public intoxication? I've already, I've already told you what you did. Sir. You refused to acknowledge it and you refused to give me your name. So, you can sit in jail until you tell them what your name is. I'm not telling you again. I've told you like six, seven times. If you weren't so drunk, you would know that I have. I don't even drink. Okay, yeah. You're going to say that the way you are right now is a sober state? That you're sober? Because you're a cop, so you're sober automatically. All right, man. That's fine. Don't identify I'm yourself. I don't care about your lawyer, you don't brother. Care about Grayson Renz is a lawyer? I don't care Grayson about your Renz lawyer. I don't, care. I don't care about your buddy that's a cop. Of course. Sure don't. I don't care. I identified myself back there at the traffic stop. I said, Dalton there. I didn't stop you in traffic. Exactly. Don't push on me, man. Listen, when I get you, you, when I get you, on, you out of this why car, are you you're not going to find anything. On me? Now get out of the car. Why are you pushing? Get out of the car. I can't get out of a car. I have pull a hurt leg, shoulder. Pull your legs out. I have three pull your legs surgeries. Out. Pull your legs out. Surgery. Pull your legs out. Grab my, now, come on. Grab my shoulder again. Turn this way. This way and stop. I'm not, I'm not doing anything. I've never been arrested. Well, you have tonight. Oh, see how bad. See Let's how go. bad. Let's go. Before I go in You're going to go in here regardless. Mr. Mr. and what is your name? Stop it. Stop. Mr. What is your name? I need your badge number and I need, Stop I need it. your name. No, no, sir. I'm doing everything. I'm leaning on the floor. Stop. I'm leaning Stand up and stop. No, sir. What is, what is your badge number? What is your... What is your sergeant's number? I need it right now. You're not going to get it. Oh, so when these cameras, when these They're cameras busy. see They're here, busy. when they request, when they that. see me request, I've told you my name. Look at you, McGruver. No, 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 I'm going to look at your name, McGruver. I bet you know Gary Carver, don't you? <laughs> you know Gary Carver. Camera, look Stop. at this. No camera, look at this. Stop. He knows Gary Carver. Yeah. His uh, face made contact with a door frame. My face made contact with a door yeah. frame? Stop. My Let's face. go. I'm not jerking you through here. Do you understand? Walk. I've never, I've never been. What did you say? My face made contact with a door frame? It did. Let's go. Where? Let's go. Where? Stop. No, where? Oh, it's about to make contact with the door frame, guys. Let's go. Come on. Stop. What did I do? All right, What's your sit down on the bed. What's your name? Sit down. What's your name? Groover. Groover made contact with my face on a thing. My face made contact with a door frame, and Groover's been in here. I bet Groover's mama's got something to say about him. You're really acting like a fool. Oh. Oh, when they shut this door, they're going to see what part of my face made contact with a door Yeah, they frame. can see it from here. Because uh, whoever's going to look at them will talk to me out here. Not yet. What do you want? You can just tell me what happened. Thanks for getting clearance. Yeah, so when we were in the, in the hallway at the Chateau, what is it, Comfort Inn Suites, I went to bring him to the ground, grabbed him by his wrist, and we spun right here. 
you can see it's got a line. It made contact with like this part of the door frame. Pretty hard. So I just got to get it medically clear before we go to the jail. Good luck. The door frame when I when I brought him to the ground and we spun over, he hit the door frame. No, he never. No, he never knocked. Never knocked him out. He didn't lose consciousness. He didn't have a seizure. He was coherent, and still continued to fight me to the point I had to take my taser out and threaten him to tase him with that. So he's, Is that it? That's it. That's it. Yeah. That's it's just. That's it. That's it. Just for a possible head injury. Keep your mouth closed. Another girl. Yeah. Been called everything in the book. So. I don't have to read your rights. But I was under arrest. I don't have to read your rights. I'm so not investigating the crime. Read me my rights when exactly. I'm under I, I don't have to. I'm not asking you any questions that would incriminate you. Look, man, I didn't start yesterday, okay? You did. Sure did. You just started yesterday. I don't have it to ask to read like. your rights, man. Well, he's, he's going to wash his hands so he can beat my ass. Yeah. Yes. Oh, you got to do something? Are you done? Okay. So we're good. Yeah, y'all right. He's discharged. I'm discharged. Thank you. Yep. You're going. Oh, great. Please help. That's all I Help. Please tell me he's not allowed to take him when I request your... You can ask him something for something else you need to so give it to you. I need his address. Will you give her your address? No, I won't go with you. Okay, you're going to go with me. I ain't going with you. Okay. You've already smacked me in the Whatever. back of the head. Okay. I will not go with you. <laughs> All right, well, we're leaving. You're under arrest. You don't have a choice. What am I under Stand arrest up. for? Stand up. Stand up. That's not my concern. Stand up. I have, I have a surgery on my shoulder. Well, if you would I'm walk sorry. on your own, I wouldn't have to jump you up out of the chair. Don't. Now start walking. I'm telling you. Go. I'm telling you. Where are you? Go. If you bust your ass, it's on you. Go. Dude, my pants are Go. down. How am I supposed to do anything when my pants are down? Well, if you'd stop acting like a fool. Now i got to pull your pants up like you're my kid or something. Okay. The best thing you can do is keep your mouth shut. You're not walking and everybody else in here is watching. Now walk. Uh, okay. Turn and walk. Turn and walk. Turn and walk. Dude. You don't like to listen. I'm not going to fight you out the door. Let's go. Stop. I'm telling you, if you if you jerk back on me, stop. Down. I hate your we Sit down. Pull my pants your knees. Up? I'm not pulling you. Pull my pants up? No. Sit down. Oh, so you're going to rape me? Sit down. Look at your look at your thing. You want Put your put your feet in. Your your thing put your won't, feet in. Your thing won't put his my feet in here cuz he wants to rape me. In. Put your feet in. Cuz his wife Sit back. To every other yeah, he don't don't come toward my face. Do you understand me? Did I come towards your yes, face? Yes, you did. How? You got my neck. Y'all want to trade? The worst drunk. Well, not the worst, but he's up there. Pretty close. It's been a while. I mean, it's not over. You gonna tell me what I'm in here for? You gonna just gonna keep? The f are you pushing on me? Get out! Why are you pushing get out. on me? Can you can get out? Get out! I'm gonna have deputies come out here and we're gonna remove you from the car. Out, get I out! I can't get out without you, my hands. You can get your. I can't get out without your feet. my hands because you put my hands in here. There you go. Now. What now? What now? I'm telling you, you're gonna go on the ground. I don't think you can't hang. I didn't Stop. ask you something. Did I you're ask not you come to get me out? Stop it! I didn't come at you. We got how many? Stop. How many yeah, you keep here? walking toward me every time I get how you out of the I'm car. I'm towards you. I, my pants aren't I'm even up. I'm telling you, when we get Will in you here, you better my angry. goddamn pants. No. Walk. Stand right here. Down Turn around and stand right here. No, he's headed to jail eventually. He's first going to the hospital because he has a laceration because he accidentally hit his head on the side. Of Stacy, just go in here. Yeah, come in here and talk to no, him. He's a good go guy. Here. Yeah, come on. Just going Why? To the because he's he very intoxicated. I know he's all by himself. himself. I'll get him to go to sleep. What is this beyond that? Stacy, just go in here, please. But, but do you speak to him? I'm talking to you. He's
He's oh, never been in Stacey. trouble in his whole life. Little, He's never been arrested ever. Stacy, let me just. Don't. He's I mean, never ever been arrested. Stacey, just go in there and let me talk okay, to him. Okay, but, but bring him I in here. Can I you please, talk to please, him. Dude, talk please to him. come speak to him? Yeah, if, if you could just go back in there, I'll be right there. There's people out here just with the cursing, you know. You're good. Over here. Dalton, Dalton's gone. Yeah, he's left. He left with another officer. He's in college. He ain't never done. She said that he ain't never been to jail. He ain't never been in any trouble. I mean, that's what that's what like first offender and stuff's for. I mean, he could he could do it and not yeah, even be on his first record. Offender. Uh, I don't something like this. I did first. So that's your wife in there with the baby? No, that's my, my wife. Yeah, that's my mother. Huh? So that, yeah, the blonde haired girl's your wife. Okay. So I talked to the manager, and the, the general manager wanted everybody going. She called. I talked to her for your wife, and she talked the general manager into allowing you and your wife and baby to stay. But the mother-in-law still has to go. Um, and whenever she would try to talk to your wife, your wife said that she would just leave with the mother-in-law. Where's your dog now? He's headed to jail. For what? The other officer, I came on the back end of it. I would be assuming, like, drunk in public, because he's very intoxicated. Yeah, I thought everybody was in the room. I was asleep. Yeah. I just woke up. You, you look like you just woke up. You look yeah. like you're cold, too. Yeah, I'm cold. And then barefoot on this floor. My wife just woke me up and said, everybody's going to jail. No, everybody ain't going to jail. Just dog. The only reason we're here is that concert. concert. Yeah. Yeah, I just woke up. Everybody. Yeah, <laughs> I told them just to, both of them, even though dude's drunk, he seems like he's got some sense. Yeah, so. yeah. I mean, like, he, he was swerving all in the pool area and all that, too, but once the daughter was like, all right, it's time to go to the room, which I, I'm guessing is his wife. His, yes, his wife. And he, 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 he tried to stay firm for a second, but then he, he finally moved along with, without any problem. Without any, he, 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 he knew it was best for him. He wasn't saying nothing. He, he he wasn't acting aggressive. He 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 wasn't doing anything. Eventually, he he went on like we wanted him to. Yeah. The other one, on the other hand, and you know, what? once he the got on the feet, that I conversed with the mother, she was fine, and she was freaking out and worried about the whole situation clearly. But then when I had enough, and I was like, okay, that's it. The cops are coming. She left. She disappeared. I don't know where she went, and then left us to deal with him at the door until I got off the phone with the operator. And then, then she wants to come up to me at the front desk and be threatening towards me. Oh, now you can go too. Mm -hmm. um, no. My little 11, 12 dollar an hour, yeah, I don't get paid enough to deal with you. No. So you can go. Yep, I don't blame you. Then she wants to say she's a district attorney. Then you should know better, right? She's a what? She said she's a district attorney. Then you should know better. Oh, wow. Of all people. Eat. Well, if she knew that, she'd know that his degrees don't mean anything right now. They're Hello. irrelevant. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Good night, y'all. Good, Good night. night. Well. Sorry for the Jerry Springer episode. That's what we get when we say hotel room. <laughs> River Jam weekend. <laughs> River Jam weekend. You never know. There might be a cop chasing. You bring your own popcorn, don't you? Bring <laughs> your own popcorn. I want to watch the cops chase, chase some drunk dude down, down the hallway. Yeah, that's <laughs> it. <laughs> cable? We don't need cable. Oh, <laughs> we got Jerry Springer out in the hallway. That's it. In the end... Mel Karen was charged with public drunk disorderly conduct and obstruction of justice.